Now, after you add a contact, we want to create an opportunity. In the previous video, I created Norman Lewis. We'll just click on Norman Lewis and we'll get dropped into the timeline. Here's your opportunity. Let's click on the link. There's create the opportunity. Here's where you have to make some decisions. You can't change the market center, but anything you see in the red asterisk is a must. So we know we are in the Houston Southwest office. I can't change that. I am the owner of it. The opportunity type, is it a listing, a buyer, a landlord, or a tenant? You're listing the owner's home to sell. You represent the buyer. You represent the landlord to lease his property. Or you represent the tenant to rent a property. Let's go ahead and put a listing in. A listing requires us to put an address. And the address will be the address of the listing. I want to go ahead and just put a price in here. And the commission rate that I'm going to get. Your opportunity phase is broken down into three sections. Either you're cultivating them and just watching them, or they've made an appointment with you to meet, to, or they've made an appointment with you to meet, or they're already signed with you and they're active. Let's just say they're making an appointment with us. And the opportunity stage within the opportunity appointments is they're scheduling it with you, they've already scheduled it, and they've kept the appointment with you. And let's go ahead and create it. That's all to creating an opportunity.